My favorite thing about art is the colors. My favorite thing about making art is the details that I have in my picture. Um, it helps me express myself in ways that I can't really do because I'm shy. I just like that it's fun. There is no wrong or right type of art and it's really fun to do. I love making art because it makes me feel good. My favorite um, thing about art is the colors. The colors, seeing the colors, mainly bright colors, because that's the ones that I like to use. Well, my favorite thing about making art is we get to learn new things like every single day. And also they hang the artwork in the hallway, which it makes it more fun to go to art. This piece of art makes me feel happy. It makes me feel great because I show my artwork to people and they say it looks perfect. I feel happy because I knew I was doing good. When I start finishing it up, I like feel excited because I don't know if they're gonna put it in the show. I feel like competitive because I wanna, I wanna make it pretty and stuff. When starting making that piece of work, I was actually very nervous because it was something I never tried before. And throughout some of it, I was still really stressed only because I was afraid of making mistakes. But by the end of it, I was actually pretty happy with my work and I thought I did pretty okay for my first time. My favorite part was when I was making all the shapes because I think they look very cool and you can make them however you want. I made it with a needle and some string and I had to put the other string under and over the strings to create the weaving. My favorite part of the art piece was definitely when I went back in and added all my final touches and details. So once I got to use my jelly roll pen to add in the white highlights and adding in the really dark shadows with my uh, black marker. Uh, I planned it out like the whole thing. I used paper and paint. It's a weaving. I weave it with different yarns on a cardboard. I'll put it in my mom's house so she can put it added to her wall of paintings I do. Different things and people inspire me. Like my family inspires me and different things I can see outside and around me inspire me. Mainly my art teacher, but if I could pick what I would want to do, I would take inspiration from Amy Sherrill. I like her art a lot. She made one of Michelle Obama that got like, you know, very, very huge and even got noticed by her. Music brings paintings that I do together. Like basically I was, you know, in my own vibe painting, just by myself with a paintbrush and some paint. I really don't like go and say, I'm going to make a painting. Like sometimes I do, but most of the time an idea just pops in my head and I draw it down and then I go to my art room and I just paint it out. A lady who is doing something good for a poor lady so I can show how she does kindness. The lady's name is Catherine. It's the story of like seasons and it's like a tree in all seasons. Um, when I was making this piece of art specifically, it was during the midst of COVID, like the first year that we went into the pandemic. And Around that time, there were a lot of emotions surrounding me about the situation, and I was able to put that on paper as a way to sort of get my feelings out. This piece is about isolation, and specifically the feelings that you get when you don't really have a place to um, say what you mean, and you're just alone. When I made it, it was supposed to be like the bear was on a podium, like, you know when you do like track or like a race or something and then there's like the third, second, first? 
So the bear was on first and it had all these like gold adornments and medals and just like a whole bunch of success. But there's like a sticky note on it. And it's like sad. And it's like, oh, why are you sad? And it's like, even though it had all of these accomplishments, it was still like on the inside, I was like, mm, this isn't really doing what, it, what I need it to do for me. So I don't know, maybe in some ways I'm like the bear. <laughs> I think it's important because it could do a lot to your future, like high school-wise, college-wise, and all that stuff, and scholarships and everything. I think it's important that you can put messages through your art and like say different things without actually saying a word through your art and through the, all the different colors and things that you put on the paper or the canvas. It's kind of like, for me, the most easily accessible method of expressing myself and being creative. It's like whenever there is a lot on my plate or I just need to get something out, like make some kind of tangible expression of emotion that I'm feeling, I'm like, okay, it's time to get a pencil and start drawing. Art's important to me because there's no other media that'll just get me to say how I feel as good as I can when I just draw it out. I just enjoy art more than anything else. I'm going to paint my room. I'm going to put a sun in my room. I'd like to practice my anime skills, like I can draw anime. I want to make a lady who is protesting to all other nice people so they can be nicer. The next thing I want to make in art is a football field because I want to make it to the NFL. I want to make a paper mache sculpture because ever since I was in kindergarten, I've wanted to do one. Next time, I want to um, draw me um, playing basketball. I really want to do sketching or I want to do sculpting with clay. I want to make more note hands because I think they're really cool and drawings. I'm going to keep doing art for a long time because I want to be an artist when I grow up, just like my family. I love art and I will never stop because I love it. I would really like for it to be displayed, but that's not my main goal for it to be displayed. Just like, I just want to make it, like just to make it maybe to hang stuff up to my house, to give some to my friends and family and stuff like that. I could become something. Art can put me out there in the world. I could become famous. You can make lots of money off of it. I sell this one, I will. I see art fitting into my future because I, I like it a lot and I'm very creative and I hope to go into a future where I'm using it career-wise. Um, I want to be a fashion designer and mix my art with my clothes. I see art fitting into my future by trying to major in illustration and have jobs that are similar to that. So animation would also be a field that I would consider going into. Um, I plan to make art into my own career. I plan to go into game development where my art can take its own form of life and I'll be able to, and other people will be able to see the world as I see it. I think that a lot of things in my life will change, you know, as I like graduate high school, enter college, all this stuff. I think that something that will never like go away or will always be a constant in my life is art. And I'll always have that to rely on when things get uncertain.